Lisa's work is about color, it's about pattern, um, it's about celebrating um, life, it's about celebrating events, it's about celebrating holidays, um, special people. You know, I, I, it's so much fun that you'll be driving down the street and you'll see Lisa Frost banners hanging on people's doors. Um, it really is about people know that, that her work is um, playful, fun, and communicates to everybody. One of the things that makes Lisa special is that she's overwhelmingly positive and we need as many positive voices in Rockford as possible and especially artists and struggling artists to have somebody who has chosen to stay in Rockford and support the Rockford community and who remains unfailingly positive no matter what Rockford goes through. One of the my most favorite things about Lisa's work is just how versatile she is. Uh, one thing I am absolutely obsessed with is her portraits. Uh, she's done some amazing portraits. Uh, if it's Abraham Lincoln or most recently I saw Martin Luther King, those to me, uh, A, I'm a little obsessed with politics, but also her work is just so phenomenal phenomenal. Uh, but then she also does amazing work, uh, quite honestly, on the windows of the uh, Visitor and Convention Bureau uh, or the mural that's right down uh, by Water Street. She's just so versatile in the work that she can do uh, and I just think we're really fortunate to have her. She's rooted in a sense of service and she's rooted in wanting to give back and she's rooted in wanting to make a difference. Uh, Lisa is about being an arts advocate. She's about supporting arts in the community. She's about um, helping young people find uh, their pathway. You know, she's just been an all-around community person. Her artwork fills the city streets. It fills homes throughout the region. Um, I was in a, I was far away in another state and I walked in and I saw Lisa Frost banners and I was so excited to to know that her work, her energy and her her cheer could stretch so far and uh, you know really affect so many different people. I think her work's amazing. I think she's uh, you know most due to be in the Hall of Fame I would say but her as a person just makes it it's just awesome. She is so contagious. Uh, I don't know if anyone has the enthusiasm and drive that Lisa does. When you're around her, you want to smile. You want to work harder and be better. And so she's just a great person. I also like the place that her art comes from. And again, it comes from seeing the world differently, wanting to see the world more beautifully. And it comes from a place of wanting to use or to marry her passions to causes or to needs as she sees them. We have to recognize our contributors in the Rockford area who make it better for other artists. They pave the way, they stay, they contribute, and they keep arts at the forefront of what matters to our community. So we're grateful to have all of our artists in town and people who bring all of them together, like Lisa Frost. As an artist and an educator, Lisa is compassionate, full of energy, supportive, nurturing. She, she's taking such a special interest in young artists in the community, from supporting them with summer scholarships to art camps, to taking on interns who've worked with her. And when you meet Lisa, it's all about, Lisa's excited about life, excited about art, and, and really excited about sharing that energy and that commitment to making sure that people support the arts in the community. Uh, there's a depth to Lisa as a person. There's so much compassion in her. Uh, that, that wanting to make a difference is rooted in compassion. And compassion and service and really caring on a very deep level uh, that, that uh, I, again, I think it permeates everything she, she does, everything she is. She is uh, just an awesome artist and an even better person. And she, uh, her ability to bring young people with her and to show them and be that uh, example, uh, just can't ask for anything better than that. I just look forward to see what, what, what is she gonna do next? You know, what young people will she support? In what way will she change the Rockford community in terms of arts? And, um, you know, where will, where, will she, where will we go next with Lisa Frost? I think that um, she deserves the award from the Rockford Public Schools because of the difference she's made in the lives of so many young people. She has literally changed the face of this city. And this city is not the same as it would be without Lisa Frost and, and Frost and Friends, and now the Mural Project, and, and the legacy, a real legacy. We'll never really know when the ripples of, of Lisa Frost end. 
because she has impacted so many different people.